Now record, you know, this recorder comes in, then press one more time. But you can make these models in any, uh, any power. If I want 500 in this model, can you make that? Yeah. Yeah. You can make it, right? Mm -hmm. In any shape and color. No. Hello. How is the sales of these small bikes? Are they still selling here? Mm. Is the sales good or how is the sales for this? Yeah, good. Sales good. Um. Go like a gas quarter. Thank you. 
This is the hotel where I'm staying in Shanghai. Okay. Okay. You can see? Who is this? Who is this? This is Aya. Your nephew? Who is this? Your cousin? Yeah. Now it's on. Now it's on. Yeah. Once you press once again, it's on. Okay. Oh, 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 我跟你说，哎，徐总啊，我们公司的人都是公斤级的，你相不相信啊？收档了嘞，收档了，镜头嘞，收档了，镜头嘞，我们公司都是公斤级的，我骗你啊！耶耶，最近我们公司有一个，有个女的也是公斤级的。我你喝喝翻你，我跟你讲。倒霉了，你也搞不过他了。我派美女，派我表妹。哎呀，表妹长得还可以、啊。什么都让你拍啊！拍拍你的儿子，拍拍我女儿。拿个东西。他会给我们发过来的。发过来。拍拍徐老板。哎，徐老板。你到时候请他们去玩好了，没事的，挺好的。This is my breakfast in the hotel room. Some bread, some fruit, some cereal. And some omelet and sausage. And some bread. That's what I eat.
go to movie camera? Oh yeah, this is a movie. Oh, this is a digital movie. Oh, okay. Actually, I can download this to a computer and uh, put it on the internet. Oh, okay. <laughs> You can you can stand there. I mean, that's okay. Okay. This is Jin, my guide from the tour company. And they're praying because they believe this kind of instrument could send their wishes to the Buddha that he knows. They in the future could control. And uh, they are uh, throwing those uh, coins. You know, what is the significance of that? What is the what is it symbolizes? Oh, uh, which one? Uh, they they are throwing those coins, the copper coins. Oh, throw the coins. Yeah. And throw the coins into uh, that instrument. Oh, okay. And they're also they are praying and sometimes it's fun. Oh, okay. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Mm. I see. Angry, yeah. So the heavy one is ready to help people and the angry one is ready to punish the enemy. Oh, okay. And how old are these uh, statues? When were they built, these statues? At the same time when the temple was built? No. Uh, it was built several ten years ago. Not oh, okay. more than 90 years. More than 90 years. Okay. Not more than. Not more than 90, okay. This is the Laughing Buddha statue in the Jade Temple. And this one looks very happy. It is called the Bodhisattva, uh, Bodhisattva Bhattriya. And he's popular known as the Laughing Buddha because he greets the visitors with his broad smile. And obviously he looks so happy. And uh, this one is according to the Buddhist scripture. He's the successor to Sakyamuni. So he is also called the, the future Buddha. Angry. Mm. This one is the Western King, and he's the King of Far Sight because he observes the world with his penetrating eyes. He's holding a dragon in his hand, which is said to keep one of spurting water from his mouth mm. to join the enemy in the place. The last king that is the northern king, and he's the king of virtue. You can see he's holding an umbrella in his hand. That is called the, the treasure stealer. Oh. Because the Buddhist scripture is often carved on such kind of stealers. So called the, the scripture stealers. Warrior's club in his hand. This one is the Bodhisattva Skandip. And oh, he's this the, is Bodhisattva? Bodhisattva, yes. Oh. And he's the leader of the four family kings. At the same time, we call him the God of Message. Mm. Because when the visitors arrive, and this is the first building they will visit, it, mm. and so he will immediately report to the Sakyamuni in the Grand Hall, let him know. Okay. So he can run very fast the God of Message. Yeah. Okay. And you can see on his chest there is a mirror. Yeah. The function that is to keep the evil spirits away. Oh, I see. Okay. So that. Uh that is, uh, you know, how, how do they, how does that uh, correspond that it will uh, uh, take the evil spirit, I mean, it will prevent the him, uh, evil spirits? How did they come to that kind of a conclusion? The mirror, the mirror was a recent thing, like, you know, last uh, oh, 200 oh, of years. Oh, uh, it's a legend, and there's some Buddha, they will use this kind of mirror oh. to let some evil spirits uh, to, uh, back to their original, uh, uh, original shape of body. Can you understand? <coughs> Interesting. <laughs> so then it was very some ghost and uh, they uh, defeated uh, the mirror very much. Mm. So 
three big statues. The one in the middle, that is the founder of Buddhism, Sakyamuni. And I think you know something about him. And uh, yeah. he's the son, he's the son of a uh, king of Sakya clan in a state in ancient India. So we see the Chinese Buddhism was introduced from India. But now something different and uh, has formed our own system. And uh, since he's the prince, so he's very rich. He spent his youth in great luxury, but suddenly renounced the world at the age of 29 yeah. in search of a final solution to the problem of human sufferings. Then after six years of spiritual discipline in the forest, and uh, he enlightened himself and he became the Buddha at the age of 35. 35. He, uh, he spent the remaining 45 years teaching his religions and uh, establishing a community of monks to continue his work. And he was given the title of Sakyamuni by his followers. That means the intellectual of Sakya Klein. And he died at the age of 80. The whole life is 80 years. Oh, he okay. lived from 565 to 486 BC of a will, non-stop. Mm. And uh, he's in charge of the world of Eastern Bright World. I see. And uh, to his right hand, and we can see another Buddha, and this one is the Amitabha Buddha. Amitabha Buddha is in charge of the Western Paradise. So he is holding a lotus blossom in his hand and the stand with which he will extradite people to a Western ship just like a fish. Because you know monks believe the fish is the most diligent creature in the world mm. and because they keep their eyes open all the time, keep awake all the time. So when the monks do their prayers, they will use a stick over there to hit it and I then see. they can keep clear in their mind. Oh, I see. Okay. That's a good belief. and they have no sex and why this one took the image of a goddess the major reason is in order to convert more women to Buddhism mm. and uh, so uh, she's riding on the head of a huge turtle we see the turtle is the king of the ocean and so once this kind of animal move it will cause calamity in the world maybe tsunami maybe earthquake so the goddess riding on the head of it to press it to protect our world okay. by her side we can see two children and this is the girl girl called the long Yu, that is the daughter of the dragon king and the boy that is called the shan tai when the boy was born with a lot of treasures and so hence the name shan tai because tai in chinese means a wealth mm. and the bear he don't like money anymore and he want to get more knowledge and so he go around to the 110 cities to okay. call on 53 teachers this goddess is his 27th teacher and on the back, you can see uh, many, many statues. The big one with the small children beside it. Can mm. you see? Yeah. So the big one, totally 52. They are all the teachers of the boy, Shan Tai. Oh. And uh, on the top, we can see a small statue of Sakyamuni when he doing his spiritual discipline in the forest. To his right hand, we can see a monkey giving him food to eat. To his left hand, there is a deer giving him the water to drink. This is the back. Mm. Indifferent thing. More hand means more power. I see. Some statues we just visited in some massive buildings. And I like the laughing Buddha and by his two sides and we can see the four heavenly kings and on the top that is the Sakya Muni and uh, around him some others and some bodhisattvas mm. so this is the Buddha king I see many dignitaries yeah many dignitaries have come here before yeah. interesting Oh, 
This artwork is really magnificent, you know, the handwork that has been made. I don't know how they made this, but it's magnificent. because this one is too heavy. The mm. boat to carry it, they, they don't have the machine to took it from the ground to the boat or from the boat to the ground. And so this one have to be left in Shanghai. Oh, I and see. And then left another smaller one to escort this bigger one. A moment, Please. A I give some more introduction. Please. And uh, if you look up, you can see totally 688 small golden statues. Mm. And they are all framed. They're all framed, huh? What is the name of the goddess? Uh, Great Mercy, the oh. goddess that were Huan Yin. Okay. No, what, what is that? Um, you never seen it before. Mm, not I know of. Uh, calendula? Is it Calendula? No. Mm. It is called the Peony. You know, this is the single flower of China and the better wealth. So that's the national flower of China? Yeah, the national flower. And you know the city flower that is the Magnolia. I see. Yeah. Interesting. Have you ever seen the silk house? And actually, I tell you, and this one and he's entering Nirvana. Oh, Nirvana. And so we say he's dying on his deathbed. So this is the Nirvana uh, pose. Yes. Nirvana pose, okay. Uh, but this one is not the real one, of course. Not made of jade, but made of marble. And marble. Was made, was donated by Singapore. Oh, I see. Because this one you can take picture the real one, not. Yeah, okay. I see. Much smaller than that big one, and this one only about 96 centimeters. This is also marble. This is all, right? Not jade. This is marble. This is jade. Oh, this is jade. Yeah, this is real jade. jade. White jade. I see. And you can see this one are so many. Actually, you know, the, uh, this goddess with one thousand hands is the symbol of the hell, H-E-L-L hell, with so many hands and to rescue the people in hell and the ground totally 18 levels. You know, once she did it, and so everybody could touch it. Yeah. Amitabha Buddha, okay. And we will begin to eat the food. So, marble leaf is the most nutritious and growing food for the secret rooms. And here are the secret rooms at different ages. This is 5 days, 10 days, 15 days, 20 days, and 25 days. I see. And 25 days is a big store. And then the secret room will stop eating because the body of the secret room is shiny and swollen with a liquid seal. And this is time for the secret room 
to win the course, it means to spin it or sail it. Mm. So here, it's a very important part. Is, is it the real cocoon? Which... Mm, this is a real one, the real oh, okay. cocoon. Each side is a paper, yeah. And then, out of the nest of habits, the body of the sick room will shrink, yeah. And then, the sick room will bat the cocoon and then come out. That, I see. Yeah, that is pupil. Yeah, here is a pupil. And water usually we feed the sick room in three seasons. The spring, the summer, and the autumn. Spring is a wise season, yeah, because you know, in spring, the weather is climate is good for the room growing. Also, mm. the mother lake is the most nutritious. So, in spring, only one cocoon can give the sick over 1,000 years. But in summer and autumn, can only give the same habit to 900 years. So, spring is the best. It's the best season. Also, the spring is the best part. So, you show you how to catch the beginning now. Mm. And that's why, because in here, this is a single cocoon inside with one pupil. Mm. Uh, it's very sharp. First, the water will put it into the pot. Water just make it sharp. And if, if this brush stirs the single cocoon to get the beginning of the sale. So are they, are they really uh, making the silk here? I mean, is, is it only for... If you want to have a try, just dress with it. I'll, I'll try that, yeah. So if you can do the, if you can do the shooting, I'll uh, okay. try that, okay? Thank you. 